baby. Hello, chickens? You do not want sex time. Hello. It is reproduction time. There you go. Think. Here. Yes. Put that XP orb into my <laughs> big axe. Why not? Okay. Um, let's throw another one. No. Unlucky. You didn't have to see your brother splat. Okay. Um. I don't. I wish they could, like, make these into potions. Like, potions of blindness or something. And then whatever creature you throw it on, they just forget where you're at and they're like, huh? <laughs> um. Oh, I didn't kill one yet. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Oops, I forget about that. Oh, my bad. <laughs> oh well. I always forget that it does that. Like, I hate that. See, this is why it's not so easy in the new um, Minecraft. Raw chicken. Yum, I'm sick. <laughs> okay. Trade that out. I like to put the smaller one there. Just that way I can finish it off and, like, open up my inventory a little bit more again. Okay. Um, so, sleepies, so we don't get attacked. Eat. Eat that I slept Z's, I sleep Z's. Um. There we go. I think these are uneven because this is going to turn out to have, like, two leftover bricks. I don't know how I began to get it uneven. Yeah, see? Ugh, okay. Get more blocks for the wall. I can finish this wall on camera, and then I can start the other one. <laughs> I'll finish this off camera. It's gonna take forever. Um, how to make... Yeah, I think we need a book and an inkwell. Ink sock. Sorry, it looks like an inkwell in the texture back. It's kind of weird. It, it, it's perfect for it. Um, and I think it's, uh, uh, I don't even need a crafting table. Uh, yeah, I think it's any random arrangement, isn't it? Yeah, it doesn't matter. That looks appropriate, though. Nice. Mm -hmm. A book and quill. It looks so cool. Hi, how are ya? <laughs> I love it. Put that in there. Um, why not test out some uh, enchanting? Since I have some magic levels. Mm, what could use it though? Let's see. Throw you in here. Um, two lapis and two enchantment levels. Efficiency two. Silk touch. Question mark. Question mark. Question mark. What about if I did this? I can't enchant it anymore. Are you kidding me? Oh. That sucks. Eggs. What about you? Yeah, no. Once it's enchanted, you can't enchant it anymore. Oh. Okay. Well. I mean, just kidding. I already know you can't. <laughs> Being dumb. Um. Ooh, go back. Um. We'll put you in there. And let's see what we can get. What would I like? I think I would like efficiency. Ooh, I got fortune as well. Yeah, magic. How fun. Okay. Lapis, you can go back. Um. Awesome. And they changed the sound for it. That was weird. The little whoosh. I love that. That's cool. Um. Let's make the brewing room. Let's make it through this wall here. Um, put the door right here. Oh, baby B, don't come through here. Hold on, let me go get this other door. Oh, baby B doesn't go. I really don't want to hit him by accident because then he's going to fight me, kill me, and that'll be sad. Uh, this way. I've been meaning to get, like, 
the shears to chop off those vines and then like collect them for decoration. Cause then I can put like, oh, let's put some vines on the side of this because then it's like an old fishing dock or something. I don't know. Ooh, let's repair this. <laughs> uh, go in there. There's so much stuff I got, like Curse of Vanishing, I'm breaking through. Like, these are useless at this point. These are the best ones. Uh, you. I need you. And I guess since we can have that one there, we don't have to make another crafting table. Save some wood. Not that I'm, like, low on it. <laughs> I live around forests. Only forests. Like, there's just nothing around here. Okay, back up into the house. Wonderful. Put a door on it. I think I want the flooring to be stone brick this time. But I usually make it so that way this is like a little border. Like it's a part of this. Here we go. Now he's safe from being like hit with a pickaxe because I'm swinging hard. Okay, and I have this. Too high. That way it's a four high room. There we go. Um, I'm thinking brewing room doesn't have to be super large. But it would be nice to have it a little bit bigger than normal. So let's start with three by three. Cramped, it feels. Um, then let's do a five by five. This way. Okay. So, how's your day? How's your day going? Hmm? Hmm? Doing school, doing college, doing something with your life. Watching videos while you're cooking breakfast, taking a shit. What are you doing? YouTubers would like to know. So we can imagine. Just kidding. <laughs> That's TMI. There's a lot of granite in this room. The other room had a lot of diorite, which helped with the flooring of the uh, big room. But I already had a lot to begin with. Diorite was like abundant as fuck. And I could always get more if I go back down into my old caves. Like, if I need it, I can go get it. Ooh, yeah. I have some of those. I could use you on there. Nose picker, do your job. I'm going to multiply this little vein into however much. So there is, I'm going to count how many veins I'm, or I mean, ores I'm mining, and we'll see how many it turns into with this fortune three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Is that it? Nine turned into twenty-six. <laughs> I love this pickaxe. It's just overkill. It's unnecessary, but I don't care. I'll use it. And the nose picker repaired itself. That's what I love about it. Okay. Um five by five feels better. Wait, is that even even? <laughs> Dumbass. That's not a five by five. That's a at this point it's a uh, seven by five. Let's do a seven by seven then. So three, four, five, six, seven. Push it back. Push it back a little bit more. So that little hole I just patched up, I can just remine again. Ugh, I swear, sometimes I'm just not very efficient with a pickaxe. I waste it. I'm like, wait, I, oh, oops. Q's right there. You know, that could be something you comment in the comments. Be like, hey, um, my question to you is, what do you use for your keybinds? Do you make Q your drop button, or do you make something else your drop button? Because I noticed some people do change it, and I never really thought there was other people like that in the world. I was like, oh, people don't change it. They keep it the same. Like, duh, no, ignorant. Um, they change it, because it's like not everyone's comfortable with Q being right next to everything else. They're, you're walking forward, and you're like... <laughs> Oops, oh my bad. There goes my sword. It's in the lava and it's dead forever. Yeah, no. I know some people change it to R. Their um, sprinting is R. Uh, 
all kinds of different things. It'd be cool to know. Comment. If your keybinds are different. If not, if you keep them the same like me, then... Um, how about you say Figly Wiggly Dick? <laughs> oh, wait, you can't... Can you even cuss on YouTube anymore? Or have they censored everything? Figly Wiggly Duck. There you go. <laughs> it's a good variation. They won't know. They won't know. They'll be like, why is everybody writing Figly Wiggly Duck? <laughs> because, ho. Um, for this chest, to move into there, I might just implode it and then everything's gonna go everywhere so i'm gonna end my inventory a little bit just that way when that happens i um don't lose any stuff oh beautiful big room um let's make the walls out of stone brick and the floor out of let's see make the wall out of uh let's do that with a cobblestone fuck it let's make it a little more rustic a little more old-fashioned for the uh, brewing room when I think which I think 1600s or the Supremes <laughs> uh, you are the Supreme darling <laughs> okay let's put this oh no there we go I love that I made so much stone brick. It was meant for the nether, but like, you know what? I can just use it at home too. I have so much cobblestone. Look at that one different colored brick over here. It kind of looks like it's a secret passage. Like if I press it, it's gonna be like, Psh, and then I can go through and like go into a stronghold or something. Looks cool. All right, this wall. This is why I have so much cobblestone and all the uh, other like fancy br uh, bricks, like andesite, granite, diorite, all those bad boys. It's because of the walls that I have to break down just to live inside of a mountain. <laughs> I know I, I should be building that house up there, but I don't want to. Hold on. I'm busy with this. This is more fun right now. I don't know why. I'd like to have two large ass bases for no reason at all. This wall. Put these torches on the floor. There we go. And here in the way. I cut through dirt like butter too, so I gotta be careful when I mine dirt. <laughs> Just because I can go whoosh, and then all of it's gone. Now I'm bald. Oh. There. And another piece of the wall. There we go. Um, the ceiling, I'm going to make cobblestone as well. Let's see. Flooring first. Oh, we can put the torches back up. Actually, it's, a, it's an odd number of rooms, so I can just go like this. There we go. I'm very particular about how I play torches sometimes. At first it's like random and then it just gets to be like more organized as I go on. There we go. Flooring all chopped up. This efficiency really works nicely. There we go. And then we can just use the same old material. Don't even have to refine it. That's nice. Okay. Sometimes as a builder, I wish that was socially acceptable. <laughs> Just use the raw material. It's fine. It looks nice. But it's like, no, I have to have it refined and beautiful looking. Just like this and that. There we go. And let's do the ceiling so it's not all patchy and weird looking. Since there's a giant hunk of like granite up at the top. There we go. Halfway done. I love how fast this damn pickaxe is. It makes life easier. Oh, and especially with my new, like, iron axe, it's much stronger now. Okay, and now the same material makes the ceiling. Ceilings are hard to do, like, you have to, like, angle. And you'll fuck up a lot. Oh, what the heck. There we go. Oh, dirt. Go away. There we go. 
I've been throwing away a lot of my dirt, as you can tell, as I look through all my chests. Just because I already used it what I needed to use it for. Which is terraforming that land out there. So now it's all beautiful. Uh, it's all grass. So I used it. And I've just been throwing it out like this. I go over here and I go... Bye. <laughs> I sacrificed the baby bee. Hold on. Oh, sorry. I had to sneeze. I know how to turn off my microphone for that. That's just... Ugh. Oh, this wall. <laughs> I still haven't done this wall. Are you kidding me? Um, let's make it out of the cobblestone as well. I just don't want Baby B to run out, so. I don't know which way is like the outside. Yeah, see, that way. There we go. And then, let's do this as well. Stay over there. Don't come over here. Oh. Okay. Beauty. There's beauty in this corner. Yeah, looks nice. Wait! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I didn't close the door. Oh, you're such a good baby bee, you didn't run out. <laughs> that means baby bee doesn't feel so captive, doesn't want to just run. That's good, at least. Oh man. I was like, wait, I forgot the door, dumbass. <laughs> oh my god. Oh no. Great. That's exactly what I didn't want to do. Now it's going to take longer to spawn. Despawn. Um, other arrow. Do I want to make a book, or do I want to make, an, make arrows? I don't know why. I just want more arrows. I only have 50. I like to keep a full stack. There we go. So we have the beautiful enchanting room, and then we have the beautiful brewing room. I'm going to go exploring off camera for nether stuff so I can find the brewing stand. And as soon as I find that, I might just set up the room and make it very beautiful. Um, I, I need to figure out my inventory because it's a mess, as you can see. Um, and once I find that nether fortress, I'm going to probably set up a little, like, battle cage with the, uh, blaze. So I can go in there and battle. Um, I'll have potions ready, fire potions. So, I'll be able to fight them. Um, yeah. So, I think that's it for this episode, you guys. See ya. Bye.